Hi there, Adam Spencer for the Cancer Council of New South Wales. One of the projects the Council is funding is a pill that looks to be more targeted than traditional chemotherapy with hopefully a lot less side effects. To tell me about it, I'm joined by one of the giants of Australian cancer research, Professor Philip Hogg. How are you going, Phil? Good, thank you, Adam. Good, this, thank you. Th this pill seems almost too good to be true. It initially came about from understanding how cancer cells feed themselves? That's correct. And it was recognised actually some time ago that cancer cells use sugar in a different way than normal cells do. And only recently we started to work out the molecular details of that. What specifically is it about cancer cells that makes them, that, that allows them to, to use sugar in a much more effective way than the healthy cells do? So if you've got a drug that does something to cancer cells but doesn't do it to regular cells, you can attack the cancer cell while the rest of your body remains unaffected by the treatment? Yes, that's the holy grail of, of cancer research and designing molecules uh, that will target just the tumour cells themselves and leave the, other, leave the healthy cells alone. And you've only got to look at the sort of treatments that people had 20 or 30 years ago compared to today to think, wow, in, in a decade or two, what we might be able to do for people fighting these diseases. Yeah, look, you're absolutely right, Adam. I think cancer, you know, I think we will get to a point with cancer where it'll become a manageable disease. Um, you know, a disease that you'll die with, not from. Hey, if you really want to do your bit to beat cancer, why not click here to share this incredible project with your friends, or click here to make a donation yourself. What are you waiting for? Click share or donate to help us beat cancer today.